What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Evelina Damore. Thank you for joining me. If you haven't already guessed from today's thumbnail, the video I will be doing for you today is a little haul on a jewelry company called Wonderland MC. Now, if you're a part of the goth subculture or the alternative scene, you've probably seen this stuff floating around on Facebook or Instagram. The lovely lady that runs the company is on fire with collaborations. Literally every influencer that I can think of has done some kind of collab and photo shoot for them, including the Butcher Babies, Black Friday, and now me. <laughs> so just this week, I've taken some really nice photos of the items that she sent me, and I wanna show you them today. So let's get into it. Obviously, the first one is the one that I'm wearing. <gasps> It's like blingy, but a little bit of culty at the same time when you can't decide if you want to be a bit princess, bit witch. Why decide, be there? <laughs> so hopefully this is focusing, but it's got a lovely silver pentagram and this is all crystal. It's got some little droplets here. It is just generally lovely. It is quite busy, so make sure when you're wearing it, you pair it with something that is quite simple. Hence why I chose an item that has a simple neckline and is of a solid material. This is just a gorgeous red velvet. I tried to wear this a few times with items that had prints on it and it just, it was too much. <laughs> it was too busy. Okay, the next item that kind of matches this are these wonderful earrings and I will get a close-up shot of them because on the front of them is a little bat. Now if you're not into wearing heavy earrings, these aren't for you. <laughs> I do get sensitive earlobes, I will put them in for a photo shoot but they're definitely not ones that I could wear all day. Just due to the weight of them I seem to have very sensitive ears. There we go, can you see the little bat? My hair is in the way. It's a pentagram with a little bat on it, it's just lovely. Okay, the other items, I will film some footage of me wearing them, but I'm just going to show you them. I keep speaking about them and I will put up the footage so you can see what they look like. These are adorable. As soon as I saw them, I'm like, yes, this is for me. So we've got silver spikes, inverted crosses, and bite me on it. It's a wee little combination of all things that I like. Now these are a lot lighter. I could wear these all day, every day. Ah, oh, look at that, I've done it again. It's still got the clear plastic protection on the back. I always do that. <laughs> Do you remember when I got those pentagram earrings and I wore them for like a good year and was saying, oh look, they're all bubbly. And then someone messaged me and said, they've got the film on them. I'm like, ah, oh. <laughs> blonde. So if you like spikes and vampires, these earrings are for you. Now, when I was asked to go to the website and select a few items, I believe, I hope I'm not making this up, <laughs> that she was transitioning into a bilingual website. So I do have some memories of finding it a little hard to navigate just due to the fact that it was in another language. But having said that, I was just looking at the photos, I knew what I liked and it all worked out fine. Wonderland MC also have a vast variety of genres that they cater to. She's got some items that are really dark and occulty and then she goes more ethereal and fantasy based and she's even got a steampunk section. So I chose items that obviously I like but it's totally worth going to her website and checking out the subcategories because there's just so many and you're sure to find something that you like. So this next one is a lovely necklace and I love the jewel on the front there. It's the most beautiful blue color, light blue color. And I like this because it molds to your body. So it's all kind of separate pieces. So when you put it on, it sits really snug. And I like to wear this one as a high choker, as I'll show you, but the necklace is quite long, so you could wear it down lower. That's how you want to wear it. The next one I chose due to its simplicity is this one here. I'm not sure if she names her pieces because she simply has so many. I imagine it would be hard to come up with names for all of them. But I will find the links if they're still available to the ones that I've selected in case you want to grab yourself one of those. And it's got this lovely little pointed diamante stabby thing kind of like an arrow. I just liked it. It sits really well. It, I can't show you. I will show, put the footage up. But it just caught my eye. It was very different to a lot of the other stuff that she has on there. And I wore this nearly every single day when I was in Hollywood recently. Now this next item I'm going to show you won't make any sense until I put it on, but I saw it on someone else and I'm like, you know what? I'm not a gold. This is kind of goldy bronze. I'm not a goldy bronze person, but I will make an exception for this. And I did say to the lovely owner that I was going to wear this in the video clip that my band will film for our cover of This Corrosion. I'm still gonna do that, it's just taken forever. <laughs> and I thought, yeah, that's really nice. And she sent me the matching earrings as well. So these are the same as the earrings that I'm wearing. They just don't have the bat on them. 
so that matches really well I will show you some footage of how that looks it's really interesting and you can put the straps different ways to kind of create your own look but a little bit of warning again this is really busy so just wear it under something plain and simple so you don't get too busy now leaving the best for last this is by far my favorite piece it's kind of got a gypsy goth vibe to it it's so sparkly there's just so much detail in it and each time I look at it I kind of find something new where I'm like wow I didn't know there's a little sigil of Lucifer or there's little coins there's pentagrams the detail of this is just impeccable look there's even a goat see <laughs> totally forgot the goat but I believe she makes these as one of a kind and I did first see Black Friday wearing these and my jaw dropped I went what <laughs> that is beautiful and I think that is a really nice touch as well where you can know that the piece that you're ordering is truly unique I'm sure she also does make replicas so if you saw a photo of mine and fell in love with it I'm sure she would make it for you too so just send her a message the detail in this is phenomenal again it's super busy so I personally would just pair it with an outfit that's super simple and make this be the statement piece. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this video and maybe seen something that you like as well. I always enjoy introducing my audience to new brands, especially when they are small like myself and they might not be known. So please comment down below if you like this video, which was your favorite piece. Are you going to go to the website and buy something else? Let me know what you bought if you did. Please add me on Instagram if you haven't already. I am very active on there. So if you want a glimpse of what I'm doing on a day-to-day -day basis, Instagram is the place to be. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.